it's definitely possible. Like I said, we need opinions from people all over the world, uh, in all different backgrounds. I'm afraid not. Even if it's up to people, it's sometimes natural disasters, it's uh, fires, it's uh, tsunamis, it's things happen and from one day you might actually have everything and the next you don't have. That's like the ideal situation for communism, right? Like everyone shares out their money equally. If you pay more, you share it out to the people in poverty. I think under capitalism it's a bit hard to imagine that. Um, I, I hope that it's possible. I uh, talk to a lot of people and I ask them, uh, does the American dream still exist? And they all say no. It's always rich people who, uh, with money, make money. Like we live in a pyramid kind of world, whereby most of the population are dominated by poor people. And if you would say completely eliminated is the wrong thing, but if we could elevate their poverty, it's possible. This is this kind of communist society, and if I use this kind of professional skills, it's because of the fact that it's not going to be able to achieve this kind of balance. So I think that this kind of balance is not going to be possible in the modern society. I actually think that this dream in the ancient Greece is 嗯，春秋战国百家争鸣的时候的思想家的心中就已经有了，然后一直传承至今，又被我们去继承。然后我们也有这样的行动力和信心吧，抱有这样的一个希望和一个梦想，就是说这样的理想的社会是可以实现的。我们不是有没有能力要做到，而是必将做到，这就是我们国家的发展的一个目标。